what's up lovely people so today in this particular video we are going to see how we can apply filters to all the pages for example if we are having some kind of visualizations on different different pages and if we want to apply a single filter which will be applicable to all the pages and all the visualizations available onto that page so we can do that and this thing is possible by using filters on all pages so the data set that we are going to use is a sample data set already provided by power bi which is a financial state so let's understand how we apply filters to all the pages in power bi so i am going to make some visualizations on different different page so let's say i would like to see the gross sales according to product so i am going to drag and drop the gross sales onto the task window and i am going to drag and drop the product onto the task window so you can see over here a default chart is coming up over here so we will make it some presentable yes and we will add the product into legends yes it looks nice okay let's move on to second page and we will be doing some visualization here as well so let's say i would like to see the profit according to product so drag and drop the product onto the task window and you can see over here yes let's convert into funnel chart yes it looks nice so let's move on to the third page and one more visualization i am going to do on the third page as well so let's say i would like to see the unit sold according to the product so drag and drop the product and you can see a chart is coming up over here and let's convert this into waterfall yes so it's look nice so we have made three visualizations on three different page so let's say i would like to add a filter of product which will be applicable to all the pages so drag and drop your product to filter on all pages and select the product which you would like to see so i would like to see the amrila cartera montena and well so, so you can see over here the product that i have selected from my filter are showing up on my visualization let's move on to second slide second page yes the filter is applicable here as well let's move on to the third page and you can see the filter is applicable here as well so by this way we can use the filter on all pages which will be applicable to all visualizations whether it's on your first page or your second page or third page or any other page so this is all about filter on all pages how to apply filter on all pages thank you so much for watching our video stay tuned with us take care bye bye